tension tension is also a force it is a two way force if you consider a point in a string at that point the tension acts in both the directions in the figure i have shown a block suspended by means of a string and on the string a horizontal line is drawn at that line i have shown two arrows one upwards the other one downwards that means at that point of the string two forces act one in the upward direction the other one is in the downward direction i have i have shown another two arrows if we consider the top rectangle as the ceiling on the ceiling the tension acts in the downward direction if you consider the block the suspended block whose weight is w on this block the force the tension will be in the upward direction now these are the directions of tension when the body is not moving as a whole when the body is not moving then when we consider the block it is acted on by two forces its weight in the downward direction and tension in the upward direction because it is not moving the net force on this body is zero so t minus w is equal to zero the net force is t is in the upward direction if you take upward direction as positive then t minus w will be equal to zero therefore t is equal to w t is equal to w the tension will be the same along the length of the string if the string is massless if the mass of the string is negligible very very small then we consider the tension to be uniform along the entire length of the string if the string is having mass then we have to consider the mass of the string also while calculating the tension for example if the mass of the string consider the horizontal line below that line if up to the block if the mass of that string is a small m then its weight mg will also act at that line at the point of line hence the tension at that line will be equal to w plus mg if the mass of the string up to that part is considered as small m let us consider a weight w is suspended from a string and the string is held from the ceiling and the entire system is moving up with an acceleration a the upward arrow near a represents the entire system is moving up with an acceleration a then consider the block whose mass is capital m then the equation of motion from newton's second law the resultant force is tension that is equal to w plus ma w for w plus ma if the same system is moving down with an acceleration a if the same system is moving down with an acceleration a then the tension will be equal to w minus ma if we consider the mass of the string and if we suppose that the mass of the string from the block up to the line is small m from the block up to the mass is small m then the tension at that line will be equal to capital m plus small m into g plus capital m plus small m into a when the system is moving up with an acceleration a when the system is moving up with an acceleration a then the tension at that line will be capital m plus small m into g plus capital m plus small m into a if the system is moving down with an acceleration a then the tension will be capital m plus small m into g minus capital m plus small m into a this is the relation for tension when we consider the mass of the string